Good day. Welcome to Partakers Friday Prayers on Friday the 7th of October 2011. Come, let's pray together. Father, as we commence, let our hearts and minds be right before you. We thank you for your Son, Jesus, and it's in his name we offer you these praises, prayers and petitions in the power of the Holy Spirit who lives inside those who are your children. Amen. Now let's have a short time where you can offer your own praise and thanks to God for things that are on your own mind and heart. If for some reason words are failing you, simply pray, Lord God, I lift up thanks and praise to you alone. Hallelujah. Father, accept these praises as sweet-smelling perfume. Amen. Now we pray for this world. We lift to you once more, Father, the people affected by the, the drought in the Horn of Africa. How can we not look at the scenes coming to our eyes without compassion? Those people fleeing drought, famine and conflict. Help those people, Father, in ways which only you can achieve. Fire the imagination of people to solve these ongoing problems. Enlighten people to give generously, to share and to be looking to the interests of others. Father, help the aid being sent to reach the destination instead of being stopped by insurgents and warmongers. We come now to praying for the needs of these individuals. Pete, Jane, Joy, Ruth, Doug, Denise, Sandra, Sarah, Nicola, and Kathy. O oh, great God, our provider, we ask and plea for a healing touch and wisdom for the medical staff treating them. Father, we also lift before you all those facing uh, uh, challenging situations, such as confinement at home, geographical isolation, lack of employment, health issues and financial pressures. Hear the cries of our hearts, O Father, and give wisdom and courage to overcome and help respective governments to send aid and be compassionate. We lift these people to you, Father, trusting that you will meet their needs in whatever situation is being faced and we put ourselves in your hands to help meet those needs where we can. Now there will be a short time of prayer where you can give to God things that are on your own mind and heart. And if, for some reason, words are failing you, then pray this short prayer based on Psalm 40. O oh God, help and deliver me from this pit, for I am poor and needy. Let's continue praying. Father, we pray that your love will take over our lives. We also pray that we would follow you faithfully, live lives obedient to you, and give praise to you alone 
in all circumstances we face. Lord, in your mercy, hear these prayers of your children. Amen. We now pray for church services around the world this weekend. Our Father God, we lift before you all those who are preaching, leading, serving and participating in church services around the world this weekend, both up front and in the congregation. We ask that the Holy Spirit would guide their minds and that the worship would be in spirit and in truth and that your word is faithfully preached. For those in countries where to meet other Christians is illegal or not condoned by the government, we ask that you continue to strengthen, guide, uplift and grow them. Let them know through your spirit, the spirit that lives within all believers, that we are praying for them. Amen. Finally, we close with this prayer of great praise. O oh, Father, may it be that your love takes over our lives, that we would follow you faithfully as your church. May we give to you alone praise in all circumstances we face together. We ask all these things, O oh, Father, through the majestic name of your Son, Jesus Christ, who died for us, and in the power of the Holy Spirit, who lives inside us. Amen. Thanks for joining us on Partaker's Friday Prayers. See you again real soon.